What's up, YouTube? Uh, as you see in front of me here, I got a new uh, gas blowback rifle. Uh, this is the WE MSK. This is the newest gas blowback rifle, just released. Semi and full auto capabilities. It does come with this new WE version mag here. It is a version 2 with a new shell. Uh, it's shaped after the PMAG and as you can see here this is uh, modeled after the Remington ACR. Uh, this gun is fully uh, ambidextrous as far as uh, all the controls on here. Um, the charging handle is ambidextrous to a point where you can uh, put this either on the left or the right hand side and I'll get to that in a different video. Uh, basically I'm just uh, gonna showcase the gun today and uh, do a little chrono test and uh, probably take apart the upper and the lower and show you guys the inside of it real quick. Alright let's do a little chrono test. Okay we'll be testing the WE MSK with 0.20 gram BBs and green gas. Rated fire test, we MSK. Alright, so there was a chrono test. It's shooting a little too hot for most fields, especially up here in uh, Northern Cali where I'm from. Um, fields up here are 400 FPS. Uh, CQB is 400 and sometimes 350. So uh, definitely an end pass will be needed for this. So let's uh, break it down and see if an end pass will work inside of this uh, so basically the controls right here as you saw me push down on this lever here that's the bolt release bolt catch right here this would be your mag release and like I said this gun is ambidextrous on both sides here uh, mag release on this side bolt catch bolt release so right there ambidextrous fire selector and like I said take it apart the gun down a little bit you can swap this to the other side here so let's go ahead and uh, separate the upper and the lower. You're going to remove this pin right here. And this front pin right here. Oh, a little stiff. Alright. Let's go ahead and slide the bolt out. This is similar to the Beta Project uh, Masada here. Let's go ahead and rotate that out of the way. And here is the nozzle. As you can see, it's very similar, and I believe it is the same size as the Wii M4 nozzle, except it has these little wings here on the side of the nozzle. On both sides here, the M4 does not have these wings here. Um, and I believe. I want to say the M4 nozzle should work in here. Uh, I believe I saw RE Tech put the aluminum M4 nozzle into the to the MSK bolt here, and I guess it works. But looks like an open bolt end pass will fit in there, no problem. So you'll be able to adjust your FPS. I'll go ahead and do another video of that later. Go ahead and put this back in. Um, this does have the uh, same style as far as uh, M4 hop up inside of there but I've taken this gun apart already here I'll show you guys it's very easy to get to the hop up the hop up bucking is that new style hop up bucking that they debuted in the Wii MMP and I'm not really a big fan of it but it looks like you can convert it to the the regular uh, style hop up unit that they had before alright so I removed the pin here slid the hand guard off I'm gonna pull this down I'm gonna push in on this little lever here, rotate this. Slide that forward. Now your outer barrel assembly will come off. And your hop-up unit and inner barrel. Very simple to take apart. 
and break down this MSK. And like I said, I'll get into this uh, hop-up unit in a different video. Just going to show you guys the basics of this gun today. show you the fire control group this is we's new hammer I guess uh, it does not have a roller which is uh, cool with me roller is a little nice to have but I don't see this having any problem without having not having one so uh, this is the bolt catch Let's see do I have a magnet around here I do with a whole bunch of stuff on it That steel oh, hammer is not. I kind of figured that. Got a feeling uh, some companies will start making uh, steel upgrade parts for these here pretty soon. Alright, so at least the bolt catch is steel, which is nice. Uh, this does have a folding stock too, as you see there. Adjustable length to pull on the stock as well. Adjustable cheek rest here. And it does come with this uh, QD uh, sling, sling loop here, which is really nice. Oh, let's not forget, it has a storage core here in the grip. Little rubber cap. Not sure how waterproof this is, so that even matters to you all right there you go like I said I'll get it all into this stuff here in, in a different video but yeah this is the new WE MSK put this back together Whoops. love this weapon it's so easy to break down oh and uh let me see if i can uh find uh some other mags here the version 2 mags standard ones i'll be right back all right i've got a uh we version 2 mag here as you can see by the phillips head screw right there on the bottom Tight or loose here. Let's go and tighten that up. And I got a short 20 rounder here. Let's go ahead and try it out in the MSK. Fine. And then we go to 30 round here. And that seems to work fine too. I think this here is worn out a little bit. Well, it's not locking back the bolt but nonetheless it works all right well stay tuned to my channel uh for more uh videos on the wii msk as far as breaking it down and what kind of upgrades or modifications uh we can do to it to make it perform better all right thanks for watching